Hey there students. Today, I'm breaking down the magic behind solar panels and how they turn sunlight into electricity. Ready to dive in? Let's go. First off, solar panels soak up sunlight and convert it into electrical energy. Unlike fossil fuels like oil and natural gas, sunlight is an unlimited resource. Fun fact, on a sunny day, 1000 watts of solar energy can hit each square meter of the Earth's surface. Imagine this. The sunlight hitting Earth in just 90 minutes could power the entire world for a year. So how do solar panels work? I'll explain it step by step. Step 1. Absorbing sunlight. Solar panels are made up of smaller units called photovoltaic cells or solar cells. These cells contain semiconducting materials like silicon that convert light into electricity. Next, the photovoltaic effect. Sunlight is packed with tiny energy particles called photons. When these photons hit the semiconductors, they make electrons excited and free-flowing. This is the photovoltaic effect. Step 3. Producing an electrical current. These free-flowing electrons create a direct current, DC, of electricity. But our homes use alternating current, AC, so we need one more step. Step 4. Electricity for your home. The direct current flows through a power inverter, turning it into alternating current. Now, this AC is ready to power your appliances. So, what's inside a solar panel? A solar panel is made from a sheet of individual solar cells arranged in different configurations for efficiency. These cells are held together with a transparent film and the whole panel is covered with high-strength tempered glass and moisture-resistant back sheets. This setup makes the panels durable and long-lasting. Each solar panel has a junction box that houses the electrical connections and output wires. Pretty cool, right? Now, what exactly is solar energy? Solar energy comes from the sun, which acts like a giant nuclear fusion reactor, producing energy in the form of photons. The amount of solar energy hitting Earth is way more than we currently need. On a clear day, about 1,000 watts per square meter hits the Earth's surface. Most of this energy lies in the visible light region of the electromagnetic spectrum. That's why most solar panels are designed to absorb as much visible light as possible. But there are new panels in development that can also use UV and infrared light. To make efficient solar panels, scientists use solar simulators to replicate sunlight, testing the efficiency of their designs. And that, my friends, is how solar panels turn sunlight into electricity. So next time you see a solar panel, you'll know the science behind it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to this channel for more videos.